uh, through past experiences, there have been a lot of teachers I've encountered that may have difficulty using technology or even know what technology to use. So my job would be to sit down with them one-on-one, -on -one, whether it be through email or through personal contact and get an idea of their lessons for the day or for the week and show them how to implement different pieces of technology into their lessons. And it may be something as simple as PowerPoint presentations for vocabulary review or introduction or even audiobooks and learning centers where one station would listen to the story instead of actually reading it to themselves or out loud and then also maybe even using computers to do research and even showing them that something as simple as a math lesson they can put the paper on the board and allow the students to write on the board and then check it from there, correct it and show them using different colors and different shapes that it could be a correct answer or a wrong answer and then that way the whole class can see it and different people would volunteer because they'd, they'd be more interested in the technology compared to just standard paper and pencil. And even with science class, putting a uh, weather map on the board and having them come over and put the different weather in the different states to show them that they can do that on their own and to help them maybe even figure out that they could be meteorologists in the class to integrate that into a reading lesson with weather or even with tornadoes and especially with doing a review game on the smart board. It's very simple to just put a question in and pick your right answer and have the students come up and figure out what the right answer would be to show them if it's correct or incorrect. This could also be part of the learning center where each group could have a chance to review what they have learned but now they're interacting with the board instead of just like I said before standard paper and pencil and to see if they, they've done it correctly or even putting a requirement on the, on the quiz and say if you don't complete 7 out of 10, you must do it again. And with even we can go with writing and having the students come up. And I know it's a lot of times the students have to write on freehand on the paper doing cursive or learning how to print. But on the smart board or another piece of technology, they can actually come up and trace the letter. And then you can erase it and have them do it again, have each student do it again. That way, every student can get a chance on the board, and that will be very entertaining for them. Or it doesn't have to be that difficult. It could be just a spinner for a game to see who goes first, or even a thermometer to tell a different temperature, and to show them the difference between Fahrenheit and Celsius. So there are different ways to implement technology, all I feel are very simple to use, and also very important to use, to keep the students engaged and to help them be more successful than they've ever been.